So I had to look at how you guys discipline your kids, your discipline, that's a big word for you guys, but <laughs> how in the UK children are corralled. What do you guys do? And turns out there's a multitude of techniques that you make available to parents. Things like um, star chart, you know what star chart is? <laughs> No, I'll tell you what star chart is. Star chart is where you think of something remotely not negative <laughs> that your child may or may not do, but you find a way to work it into the conversation so that at the end of every day, this child, regardless of its actual behavior, has got a star. Thank you for only kicking mummy seven times in the face today. Here is a star. <laughs> Good it wasn't eight. Another thing is naughty step. You know what naughty step is, don't you? Yeah. You have been terribly behaved. Kindly go and relax on the staircase. <laughs> and I thought to myself, I can't do this. But what were the things our parents said to us to discipline us? And I thought, of course, here's one thing our parents did. They implicated us from the time we were very young in their death. <laughs> and then use this as a way to guide our behavior, okay? I'm gonna give you an example. What is your name? Nicola. Nicola, can I use your name for this? Cool. So Nicola, imagine you're four years old and your mom will say to you, Nicola, I told you to put one spoon of chocolate in your milk. Why have you put two? Because you want me to die. <laughs> it is very effective with small children focuses their mind at once. <laughs> and by the way, Nicola, your mother could be from anywhere in India. Say she was from Gujarat. She would say, Nicola, bhecha much mukyo, but a loy piyo. Nicola. <laughs> Nicola, you put two spoons of chocolate in the milk. Why are you bothering with milk? Drink my blood. <laughs> oh, or if she was from Punjab, she might say, Nicola, do chamach paye. Are Nicola, me pitta jawa. <laughs> Nicola, you put two spoons of chocolate in the milk when I said one? Fine, fine. I am going to beat myself. <laughs> to death, Nicola. <laughs> you please stay here, enjoy your milk. <laughs> or Nicola, my mother spoke Hindi. So what she might have said is, Are Nicola, chammach kya tan tan aryo, chura uthao. Nicola, why are you tinkling that teaspoon? Pick up the knife, you know, it's what you want. <laughs> And I have to tell you guys, this was working so well for me until I got a phone call from my son's school, my firstborn, when he was about seven. <laughs> and the teacher said, could you and your husband please come in? Your son has some very specific anxieties. <laughs> so I went. I didn't take my husband because he is Danish. <laughs> and his entire parenting repertoire is, darling, please be very, very, very happy Here's some Lego. <laughs> so I went. And the teacher said to me, she said, he, we just can't understand. He's such a lovely boy. He gets along with everyone else, but every time we give him an assignment and he gets it back and he hasn't got full marks, he says, oh, I don't want to go home today. I think my mother might be dead. <laughs> On the inside, I was like, yes. <laughs> My boy is listening to me. Thank you for watching Solar Theatre on YouTube. Subscribe now for more best company.